Thank you for watching our videos on Sane Auto. Just remember, if you try anything you see in these videos, you could end up burnt, bruised, and bleeding just like me. But if you do do something that he does in his videos, just be careful and you'll save a lot of money. No hospital bills now, but a lot of money. You see that? And then your wife will take it and she'll put it down here like <laughs> this. watching this video is because you're awesome and you're about to learn something that makes you even more awesome. Okay in this video we've got a new emblem for the steering wheel and is it really that easy just to replace this? Well we're gonna find out and if you want to get this at a very affordable price just look in the description of the video find it there I do not recommend using a pocket knife for this get the plastic oh sorry guys I mean bump you around there use your plastic trim tools which I have but I'm being lazy and don't want to go get them Started. You can also cut yourself pretty good doing this with a pocket knife. And yes, you're going to have to listen to the horn a little bit. Oops. I'm going to have to pull that out with a pair of pliers. I just switched to my plastic trim tool because I really, really don't want to stab myself in the face with a pocket knife. And the way this week's been going, and the amount of force I'm having to put on this, I figure that's exactly what's about to happen. Stabbed in the face with a pocket knife. Does, does not sound like a good idea. card does not like what I'm doing. It's just really protesting. Oh, sorry guys. Well, if you was hoping for a video that showed you how, that this was really easy, I'm sorry to disappoint you, because this is not easy. I mean, it's not like having to pull a transmission or an engine out, but dang. It's kind of a pain. Oh, there we go. Slowly, slowly, so it doesn't break off. Right. Now, it's pretty obvious. This goes in one hole, comes across, out the other side. So, there, and, yeah. And you see on the back side, yes, that was all melted across the middle there. And if I hadn't trimmed it right there, I might have broke this off 
just like that one broke off. But luckily I did, and it pulled out all this plastic meat here. And that way, all three of these stops came out. And we need all that out, because we need to be able to get all these stops to go in there. Now we got to try and pull out the re remainder of these three pieces we have here. And we've got some needle nose here. So now, if you're going to do what I'm going to do and take a drill bit and a drill and get these pieces out of here and make a new hole right here, you got to be extremely careful because this is basically just a cover for an airbag system and the whole airbag assembly is in here. Might as well clean this while you're here too. It's got all kinds of nasty stuff that got up underneath that emblem during all the years of use. And now's your chance to get all that out of there. Yeah, that's, that was nasty. Would definitely be a lot nicer if it was just to yank it out and shove the other one in there kind of thing, but I think it's gonna be worth it because dang, look at the difference. Ever seen an airbag blow up in somebody's face? In the next video, get off the couch and get dirty. Welcome to St. Auto. We're so glad you're here. We don't just do repairs and tool reviews. Bienvenida a St. Auto. Nosotros no solamente hacemos reparaciones. We also film hot rods and mod rods, project cars, classic cars, antiques. Nosotros también filmea autos antiguas, mod rods, hot rods, cualquiera. We also like to take you with us to the car shows and the cruise ends, so make sure you subscribe and hit that little bell so you don't miss anything. Me la gustaría llevarte con nosotros a los cruise ends y car shows. Entonces, empuja ese botón y toca la campaña para que no pierda nada.